not what might be, not what could be, not what should be, what is, okay? And we have to make decisions based upon what is, not what we wish it was. The dream is the finished product. The nightmare is the setbacks, the adversity. The nightmare is the dream stealer. The dream that God placed in some of your hearts is that he would use you, that you would do something that would be significant. And now all you're experiencing is the nightmare and darkness and it, it feels like that God has forgotten all about you. And my advice to you would be to stop identifying with the group and start identifying with the can work. Because at the end of the day, guys, one plus one is always going to equal two. When you find yourself flailing in an ocean of why is this happening to me? When it feels like your guardian angel put in his two-week notice two months ago and just decided not to tell you. When it feels like God is a babysitter that's always on the phone where you get punched in the esophagus by a fistful of life. Remember that you will survive. Remember things could be worse. Remember we are never ever given anything that we can't handle. The human heart beats approximately 4,000 times per hour and each pulse, each throb, each palpitation is a trophy engraved with the words, you are still alive. Anything worth doing is worth failing over. Sometimes you just have to endure the nightmare. But if you want to give yourself to something, give yourself to something worth failing over. So, cast out the lies, burn them down. listen to the truth. The truth is this. If you're willing to pay the price, and you're willing to do the work, and you're willing to take the time, and you're willing to consistently get up when you are knocked down over and over and over again, which is going to happen to you, if you're pursuing anything outside of the norm, you can make it here We all face situations that look like they'll never change. And it's easy to get discouraged and accept that it's never going to work out. Mountains represent obstacles, things that look permanent, like it's immovable. Depression can be a mountain. Feels like you'll always struggle with it. A mountain can be people at work that are not for you. They have more seniority. What can you do about it? Or how about a mountain of debt, lack, can't get ahead, it's been in your family for years, but this is a new day. That mountain is about to be turned to a molehill. If you don't have a purpose that's greater than yourself, you will never feel fulfilled. You can never be happy, and you can never uh, feel, quote unquote, alive. All right, it's a very empty existence to live exclusively for yourself. Chances are you will realize that the desire to rest was just weakness. It was just the desire to take the path of least resistance, the downhill path, the easy path. And by simply going through the motions, you overcame that path. And you stayed on the righteous path, the disciplined path. You stayed on the war path. If you choose, you can also find every excuse as to why you won't make it. You can find every reason, if you look for it, as to why you won't make it. Society is counting on you. Society is counting on you giving up. Because if you give up, then you could become dependent on the government system to provide for your whole life.
during that time, on your way, the pathway to your dream, don't let anybody else's opinion become your reality. Are you going to face this issue with courage and with resolution? I say lead. Lead. Step up to the challenge. Be the one that other people look to. Absorb that impact. Absorb that negativity. Draw fire. Say, draw fire. Bring that pain to me. You can't do this. Look, I don't care who tells you that you can't do it, you're not going to be able to do it, you can't win, the game's rigged against you, you're just a regular human, success is for other people. One that has what it is that you're looking for out of life. Listen to those people. I want to declare today that your dream is greater than your nightmare. I want to declare today that your dream and your destiny is going to outlast the devil's nightmare in your life. He that endures to the end shall be saved. And weeping may endure for the night, but joy is coming in the morning.